I, I just remember, like, one of them would be going off and they'd, like, knock each other back on, and I was just like... Yeah. Well, How? it's funny that you mentioned teams because there's been a lot of talk in this match. There should be. About dropping teams from tournaments. What? Because there was a tournament recently where teams ran late, and they had 170 entrants. Of course for teams are going to run late. Right. They pushed the bracket back, and then because of that, Project M singles got canceled. Because the Oh, the melee, well, yeah, that's a problem. Yeah, because the melee entrants were so numerous, they had 170 entrants for what was just supposed to be around a 100-man tournament at Fight Pit 4. Well, let Something me, I was telling you about the other day. Yeah, well, let me let me ask you this. Is so, that is that Maybe we should drop doubles. Just is that a doubles fault, or is that a tournament ran fault? It was I the would tournament say it's organizer's the, fault. Yeah, that's the organizer's they, fault. They it's not doubles. done in one day, and they didn't plan for 170 entrants. So it's not their fault, but out of that, there's been a little bit of It's one of those about. bittersweet things. Yeah. I think doubles is where melee really shines. If you get a team that truly works together, because there's there's two dynamics in doubles. Either you get yeah. players that are teaming together because of their skill level, or you've got players that do team together often and have chemistry like you, s and your PBU, or your Mango and your Rookie. Mango being yeah, yeah, no, 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 no. Mewtwo I, King and, uh, and none of those names sound familiar. Mewtwo today. King floats around. S Fat and PPU actually newcomers. When MLG was going on originally, I think they were maybe fourteen years old. Oh, so, okay, so they've they're been toddlers. Play, they've been playing since then, but they have grown up to two of the top ten players in the world. Is age a factor in Smash? Not at all. Not at all. Okay, Not because all. you see, the, mostly it's time okay. that matters. You see the people who've played longer that are doing better. Armada has been playing since he was fourteen. 15. Huh. Hacks uh, Aziz Aliyami from the East Coast, Hacks Many. He's one of the better players in the world. How do you point. know all this information? I don't world. understand. Watch a lot of Smash. Yeah, I think you watch a lot of Smash, but there's. <laughs> it's it's an interest, so it's something that I like to remember. I like regurgitating knowledge to people, I like discussing it. So. I, I just. It's impressive. Like, I, I know, like. Well, I, and you know, from like Call of Duty, okay, well, it's more like team based. You know, more right. about the teams than you really do about the individual players. But, like. I don't know. But, well, and that's that's why I like teams so much because yeah. it's nice to know about the individual players, but when you see that team dynamic, that really adds a whole nother level to the gameplay and to the game itself. In my opinion, you get something more out of it because there are things that happen in teams you don't think about in some ways because of the muscle character. <laughs> what a fail! Yeah, Brover does unfortunately with the SD right there. Jano, actually a really old school MLG player, he mains Falcon out of. Eastern Kentucky, Ohio, somewhere in that area. Eastern Kentucky. Yeah. He's a speedrunner, if you're familiar with the speedrunning community. Really? Look at Uh As the last that I knew, he was speedrunning Super Mario 64. It's one mm. of the more popular games in that community. Interesting. Uh, yeah, he actually convinced my friend Caleb to come hang out today. He's uh, Caleb Part 42 on Twitch, if you guys know him. He's the world record holder for Mega Man X. So he wanted to come to see Gianna. <laughs> Dude, speedrunning's so badass. I'll speed be the first to cool, say. Speedrunning's badass. Not Zelda, though. Zelda's stupid. <laughs> Zelda is really dumb, and the reason why it's dumb is because of the bomb glitch. It takes mm. away from everything. Like, I don't want to see a guy plant a bomb and then jump backwards and plant a bomb and jump backwards. It takes away from it. Like, Mario's awesome. Oh, yeah, SM64 is a great game to watch. I oh, really yeah. enjoyed it. I would go to Caleb's house a lot. I've been friends with him since high school, and he, for a while, was uh, attempting to do some speed runs on Super Mario 64, uh -huh. and they were a lot of fun. There's, there's a lot of different things to go into. You have to be really, really precise on a lot of stuff. Oh, I can imagine. Yeah. I mean, just watching it's like, it. It's akin to Melee almost, uh, with the amount of accuracy. Hmm. Have you guys ever had, like, an actions per minute uh, statistic with, like, buttons or anything? Uh, is there any way to do something like that? Yeah, there definitely is. Um, it's somewhere around the same level as competitive StarCraft. I think six actions per second or so. Really? Five to six actions per second. I so guess it would be very hard to do that with the joystick, too. You know what I mean? Uh, you know, because you, that's you technically... Adapt. No, 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 no. I mean to track, like, actually oh, per minute. Sorry. Um, yeah, you can definitely plug something into the controller. And we'll show you that, that would be badass to say. Yeah. I would be very interested to see how that carryover is. Right. But Jono is actually doing a pretty good job here. Yeah, no. Well, he almost had a combo going there. I don't know which. Jono is the Captain Falcon. Okay. Why is he relevant? Yeah, I Falcon never remember Giano. seeing him play. Captain Falcon? Yeah. Well, Isaiah really wrote part of the metagame for Captain Falcon back in the day. You he's had, in the doubles, right? Yeah, he's yeah. in singles, too. He was oh. really one of the foremost Captain Falcons. He was a trailblazer. And he did a lot of things back then that people just kind of rediscovered. That's a lot of like the first hit of neutral and it puts him in stun enough so you can get a grab out of it if you all cancel just the first hit. Uh, <laughs> yeah. It was almost a really, almost <laughs> I a really have no thing. idea anything you just said. My my like technical terminology stops at like wave dashing. No, that's fine. Yeah, that's we'll get you trained up. Man. <laughs>
I would start playing this. It, it's. I mean, the thing about this is that so many people don't understand like why it's so successful as like an esports. Jono styling a little bit, going for the falcon kick to bounce off the wall. I know. Uh, well, if you falcon kick into a surface, it kind of just resets. Oh, ah, that's kind of neat. You don't keep traveling for it. So he jumped off. This is actually a pretty close game. Yeah, this one's actually. Oh close. God! So Brover just takes the lead. Very good. I like that. Uh, I that's what I'm talking about. Show him your tail, Fox. Yeah, I believe Brover was from Central Kentucky. So that's nice to see a little bit in the Midwest versus even more here we in the go. Midwest here. But even stocks. The battle. Giano Who has the pro. bigger testicles is the question. I think Giano's, I think he's screwed. Oh, Giano started a good combo there, but missed the read on the tech. Let's see if he can get this tech chase. You get, oh, he's looking like Silent sick. Spectre with these grab reads. And very smart to shine on the Oh, God. Sorry, Fox. Rest in pieces, bro. Yeah, John yeah he's done. a little fun going for the grab instead of the knee. Oh. Imagine he loses. <laughs> yeah, well, we almost saw that Home. with the so... Yeah, yeah a little that, that was there. that was fun. That was a fun game. That, did they already play two stocks now? Uh, yeah, right. that was the second match. It was, uh, the first one was... Mm. It, it's so fast! Community. It's so fast. Smash is so, so fast. Yeah, if you look at it in comparison to other Smash games, I'm not too keen on 64. Project M and Melee are pretty close. How but if you compare you. it to Brawl, Brawl matches tend to last around five minutes or so on Ooh. average because it's slower gameplay. How dare you but not like N64? I didn't say I didn't like it. No, no, no. no. You, not, you said I'm not keen, right. which is like the I'm not knowledgeable same. of the game. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah, we're going to come back with this talk here in just a second. Then we're going to go back <laughs> to the commercial break.